So the IRS has not released any specific guidance regarding NFTs. We're not even sure if they know what NFTs are. All right. But the tax implications of any specific NFT would depend on a few things. Whether you are creating or investing in NFTs, whether your interaction with the NFTs is a hobby or a business. For instance, the gas fees you pay to mint an NFT could be a taxable event. If you spend Ethereum that is worth more at the time of minting than you originally purchased that Ethereum for, then that's a capital gain. So spending it as gas right, means you actually may end up having to pay taxes on that gas if you paid less for it than it was worth when you spent it. If you create a lot of NFTs as a business, the gas fees are treated as ordinary income. Uh, but these could also be considered business expenses. So again, back to the earlier point about tracking those business expenses. So if you're creating NFTs as a hobby, you're required to report any income, but you cannot deduct any business expenses related to it. But if you're running an NFT business, again, you can deduct business-related expenses uh, from the creation and selling of the NFTs. So uh, hopefully this is kind of making sense. There's a lot here. Uh, selling an NFT or exchanging it for another NFT triggers another taxable event. Okay, It is taxed as income since you're earning or losing money from the sale. Any royalties you earn for an NFT you created would also be taxed as income. All right. So lastly, um, from a tax standpoint, investing in NFTs is very similar to investing in crypto. Your tax burden is determined by gains and losses you incur from buying and selling and, and how long you've held. All right, so as you can see, we're here to help and to try to navigate complicated tax laws. We're not your tax advisor, uh, but we try to give you information that hopefully is more useful than not. If you have any tax liability from your ABRA transactions, we'll automatically send you the forms you need. In fact, most, if not all, of the forms for 2021 have already been sent out. If you still need them, please contact our customer support, and we will make sure you have everything you need. All right. So that was exhausting. Uh, hopefully it wasn't as exhausting for all of you, uh, but that's, uh, that's where we are on taxes. 